Hey guys, I've got a tweak for you today. It can boost the headphone and speaker volume on the Nexus 5. It doesn't require a special custom kernel, but it does need root. So for me, the Nexus 5 speaker volume is pretty low. I have to have it on nearly maximum volume the entire time to actually hear it, and this tweak definitely helped me. Okay, so let's get to it. You're gonna need a root file explorer. I'm using ES file explorer. And firstly, let's make sure the system is mounted as read and write, otherwise we can't actually edit anything. So click mount read write, change both of these to RW, press okay, and you're ready to go. Now you need to head over to your root directory and the folder we're looking for is etc. Dive into that and then look for the file mixer underscore paths xml. You should see it somewhere near the bottom. And we're going to open that up in an editor. I'm going to use the ES note editor. And if you're using the same one, make sure you hit the overflow menu and press edit. Otherwise, again, you can't edit anything. And now we're looking for speaker. So you'll see a lot of text. It's somewhere near the bottom. It says speaker. I'll point it out as soon as I find it. There you go right there. That's where it says speaker. And just underneath that, you're looking for RX7 digital volume. By default, it's set to 88. I wouldn't go above 95, otherwise you may get distortion and you may damage your hardware. So I'll change this to around 93. And uh, that's it. Now we're going to be looking for the headphone section. You don't have to do this if you don't want your headphones to be boosted. But if you do, find the headphone section and then find HPHL volume. They're both set to 15 by default and we're going to be changing these to 20. If you're wondering where I got these values from, it was from an XDA thread. There's loads of people using these same values, so I thought I might as well use the same. There is also a flashable zip if you don't want to do this manually, but in all honesty, I thought manually was easier. You don't have to download any files. You don't have to go into recovery. Make sure you hit back and hit save, and then just reboot your device for this to take effect. And we're back, and if we unlock the device... Straight away, I can tell that that unlock sound was louder than it ever has been. I'm not sure how well you'll notice that over the video, but I'm sure you'll notice if you actually try this on your own device. So yeah, it's a lot more usable at half volume and full volume is noticeably louder. So don't forget guys, you are modifying the system partition here. So if you do want to install an over the air update, you will have to change these options back to the default values. And as always with the system partition, just be careful. So yeah, let me know what you guys think. Peace out.